Hey guys, I'm Paul. Today we're having a look at some of the new Mark V surface gauges from Cygnus Instruments in the UK. Here we have the Cygnus 2 hands-free and the Cygnus 4 general purpose. Now as well as these, there are the plus models, but we're going to look at those in another video. So here we have the case that all the Mark V gauges comes in. It's a nice convenient carry size. The front here we've got a pocket. At the moment that only has the shoulder strap in it. You can put anything in there you want. Once we open it up, you notice everything inside is nice and foam fitted, makes everything very secure. First thing we've got here is the Cygnus gauge itself. Also got a lanyard, this is very very handy for the Cygnus 2s. Inside we've got a little pouch with a little loop on it to fit on your belt. Inside the pouch we've got all our accessories here, so we've got some couplant, the membrane couplant, we've got 20 spare membranes and a membrane key. Also got some spare batteries and a 15mm test block. Now in the front you notice all these cutouts, these are for all the probe options. So by standard we've just got the S2C probe, this is a 2.25 MHz 13mm probe, standard for all the Cygnus gauges, but there are a couple other options available that fit nice and snugly in there. Up the top here we've got one final pouch, inside here we've got USB cable for upgrading all the firmware our probe cable, and then just all our other little bits and pieces, our certificate of conformance and our user manual. So here we've got the two gauge bodies. First difference you're going to notice between them is the screen. So the Cygnus 2 has this small screen on the top. The reason for this is to be used hands free, so you can either wear it around your wrist like this, or you can use the provided lanyard and hang it around your neck and easily be able to see the display without actually having to hold onto the gauge. Cygnus 4 on the other hand is a general purpose gauge. It has a large OLED display on the front, very simple to read. Now that's pretty much where the differences end. They both have the same nice solid feel to them, both twin shot injection molded bodies, so they're both IP67 rated, they're also going to take a fair bit of punishment. The buttons on the front are all rated to 100,000 depressions. On the top here you've just got a standard Lima 1 connection. The back here, once we open it up, got three just standard AA batteries. We've also got a USB connection for upgrading the firmware. So the gauges are very easy to operate. Simple power on. Okay, and now we're ready to make some measurements. So once it's set to the right velocity, which is just done in the menu here, it's very easy just to take measurements. So the Cygnus 4 we've got here, some easy to read measurements on the large OLED display. Cygnus 2, exactly the same, except this time on this display on the top. So once again, just take measurements, very easy to see the readings. But in this case you maybe hang it from your neck or on your wrist and just get the display on the top. Now Cygnus also have a feature called through coating measurement or multiple echo measurement. Now the reason for this is to allow it to measure through coatings up to 20 mil thick. So here we have an 8 mm block. We've got a few different coatings of different thicknesses on the top. I'll put the gauge on it. Notice it measures 8 mil on the first coating, still gets 8 mil. On a thicker coating again, also 8 mil. Now if you activate a mode called deep coat mode, which I already have turned on on this gauge, you can measure through a really, really thick coating. So this sample is about 20 mil thick. And as you can see, it is still only measuring the steel underneath. So Cygnus has continued their history of producing excellent quality gauges. Once again, the Cygnus gauges have three year warranties and six months on the probes. All the gauges are available through Russell Fraser Sales, so if you'd like any more information, please feel free to have a look at our website or give us a call.